All right, here with some of the Lady Bruins after two really big wins for us, Coach Erskine and, uh, and Methodist University, two really good programs. So just kind of take me through today. What was, what was the keys for us to, uh, to really come away against, uh, again, against two very solid programs? Yes, we're really excited about getting to play Erskine again. Last year we played them down at their place, felt like we didn't play our best match, and we were looking forward to a rematch. Thought the girls just stepped up really well. And then we've never played Methodist, their Division Three program. Um, they're a team that we'll probably see more often. And so um, to get them into our gym tonight and for us to really step up, uh, it was a really great, both matches, great matches for us. Let's talk about the Erskine one a little bit first. Um, you know, they came back in the second set and really um, were neck and neck with us, ended up taking the second set. So what does it say about our team to, uh, to have a tough loss like that in the second set and be able to come back and, and win the next two? Right, just play our game. And our game is playing good serve, serve, receive, trying to win that game within the game and then trying to feed our big hitters at the right times. And I thought, again, everybody at different times contributed. Laura, we'll go to you, uh, particularly that Erskine game. As Coach said, we, we had the opportunity to play them last year, and I believe we were somewhere in the neighborhood of like 9-0 and or 10-0 and when we played them and ended up losing that match. So um, to come in, we know a little bit about them, but, but how big was it for us to be able to get a win against a, a Division II, NCAA Division II program? I think it was, it was really good. It was a nice uh, booster for us to know like, what, we can, what level we can play at and how high we can go. Defensively, you and, uh, and Catherine and Emma were really big at the net tonight. So just talk about um, really in both matches the, the tone that you guys tried to set uh, being up front. Um, in my head, I like to think of a stone wall. Um, and then I tell my, my other blockers that. And then we practiced a lot in practice to get where we were. Absolutely. All right, Victoria, uh, from the offensive perspective, you and Brooke and, and several others really uh, kind of had your way in terms of uh, picking apart the def defense with kills. So um, how do you feel like offensively in both of our matches tonight that we, we played together as a team? I think it definitely started with the pass. Our pass, our defense was great. And then we were getting great sets. And then as we were getting the sets, our the rest of our players were calling for us where to hit. So it's definitely a team effort. Like it shows up on our stats, but it's a team effort every time. Every or both of these matches, both Methodist and uh, and Erskine, it seemed like we would get a lead, they would come back. We'd get the lead again, they'd come back. Um, so Victoria, to you, like how 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 what does it say about this team when we can have a team come back and yet still remain focused, composed, and, and go on to close a set? I think we do. Like we get sometimes we get in our heads, but we're very good at encouraging each other. And that encouragement pushes us out of our heads, and then we can go ahead and keep fighting and get back in the game and then finish how we like to. Yeah. Coach, going ahead this week, uh, we got Piedmont College uh, coming up on Tuesday, uh, another Division Three program, another program that we were able to play last year a couple of different times. So uh, just tell me what we're going to be taking from today's matches and the good performance into, into a tough game on Tuesday. Well, yeah, the, our style of play this year is to really try to get our offense be a little quicker, have a little more options on offense. And our passing game has been really, really good this year, and that's going to open up our offense a little bit more. So as we go into this week, that's going to be something we're going to focus more on. All righty. Thank you, guys.